season, you have teams, Greg, that start out hot only to falter. Uh, how do you separate the real from the rest? Kevin, that's a good question. And, and one thing is what we call point differential. It doesn't just look at wins and losses, but margins of victory. And it can indicate who's really built to go the distance. Here are the starters for Milwaukee. We'll see the talented pair of Middleton and Giannis at forward. Beasley is out there with Damian Lillard. And it's Lopez in at the five. Getting another opportunity here to see that powerful rejection. And an early swat like that can really set the tone. Now the shooters will be feeling his presence. And that one is good by Beasley. There's so little ego in Giannis's game. It's not about him out there. He wants to make the game easier for his teammates. Maxi with it. Lillard picks him up. And it's sent back by Lopez. Lillard surveying the D. Middleton the pass to Beasley. Nice ball movement by Milwaukee. The kick out to Adetokounmpo. Just five on the clock. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. Here's Heald. That's in. Coming off the assist from Embiid. Nice pass by Embiid. Smartly taking advantage of a wide open man. Alert against Maxi. Shoots from 12. And it's Lillard missing. Ooh, might rest that one a little bit. Pretty clean look inside. Alert against Maxi. Passes it to Harris. To the inside. Here's Embiid. Off to a good start as he hits his first shot attempt. Once Embiid has the ball in that spot, it's lights out. Bucks have gone one of three for the field to start this one so far. And to the Kumpo. Oh, yes, yes, yeah. Have mercy. Wow. Oh, my. That is freakish skill from Giannis. And they're bringing you up close and personal on the AT&T 5G Slam Camp. Just about two minutes into the game. First quarter of basketball. Healed the pass to Embiid. That's tipped. It's so about it's a Kumbo. And it's a Kumbo. The instincts and anticipation. Great effort here by Giannis. 76ers have gone two for four for the field so far today. Maxi with it. Lillard picks him up. And Bede with the screen on Lillard. Here's Maxi. Trains it from beyond the arc. And he likes to get in a rhythm early. Nice triple. And Beasley has the ball here for Milwaukee. They are coming off that win against Atlanta. Yeah, I mean, we saw them do a little bit of everything in that game. Showed a lot of versatility. It really is fun seeing an offensive function like a well-oiled machine. I'll be interested to see if they can keep doing this. And that one's good by Lopez. Whatever drawbacks Lopez may have, scoring in the post isn't one of them. He is a nightmare for opposing defenses to deal with down low. Now here's Heald. Last game we saw him score 13. Harris inside. Donis is there. Shot clock at six. Harris kicks to Maxi. The three. Antetokounmpo pulls it in. And to put things simply, this has not been his order. And Greg, with the coaching changes in Milwaukee, where are they looking for improvement? Oh, Kevin, they, they've been dominant in the regular season, but the playoffs require adjustments. That chess match is where they hope to improve. Maxi against Lillard. Maxi looking it over. Another miss by Maxi. And the stroke definitely lacking confidence this quarter. Nothing on target. Lillard fires away from way outside. No good on the three. The 76ers trail by five. Now Maxi. He's coming off a 34-point game against Boston. MB. 
the putback. He hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance. Here's Antetokounmpo. A 20-point game for him in the win against Atlanta. And equally impressive on the backboards. I thought his rebounding was huge. Now, here's Portis. Three-pointer Lillard. It's hauled in by Harris. He's been off. Still, they're up, so not all is lost. And there's the pass to Maxi. To the right side. Embiid against Portis. Down to five on the shot clock. Embiid inside the line. It falls for his fifth field goal of the night. Now shooting five for eight. When we talk about guys seven feet plus, is Embiid the top shooter? I can't think of anyone that's a little bit better. It's out of the Kumbo on the wing, guarded by Harris. Crowder kicks to Beasley. Lillard from outside. And Philadelphia grabs the miss. They couldn't put the pieces together, losing that last matchup with Boston. Yeah, tough game on the road. The guys you're defending, obviously comfortable shooting in their own building. You've got to find a way to break their rhythm. Well, they weren't fighting through screens. Their closeouts and rotations were late. You name it, and let's just say they didn't do it on defense. Pick works well there. Not much resistance from the D. Yeah, that just comes down to a lack of effort. The defender has to do a better job fighting through the screen. Now here's Beasley. He's got six. Overhealed. And Embiid with the block. Every year he's a defensive player of the year candidate. His instincts, that's what makes Embiid outstanding. And his awareness of when to go for the block. Alert against Maxi. that time on the shot that would have put them on top. And it's Antetokounmpo with the ball. He'll bring it up for the Milwaukee Bucks. 13 points was their biggest lead in the game. Beasley finds Lillard. Another miss, and they've really hit a rough patch here. Philadelphia's gotten cold from deep in the second quarter, just two or six from long range. Axie passes to Embiid. And they double up Embiid. Oubre, no one around him. From outside, off the mark. Milwaukee in the lead. Pass to Beasley. 1.14 left to play here in the second quarter. Love the effort on defense from Hill. When he's engaged, he can come up with blocks. Got a hand on it. And B running the floor. And when they've gone to him, he has come through big time. You got to keep getting him touches. Milwaukee has gone an even 50% from three-point range in the second quarter. Four for eight. Lillard against Maxi. Lillard, the pass to Andre Gumbo. And it goes down two points. Andre de Kumbo's got 17. And with those points, he puts it into that 10 0 run by the Sixers. On the wing, heel. For by Beasley. Heel kicks to Uber. Pass to Maxi. Shoots over Lillard. It's rebounded by Portis. And the well is running dry for him right now. Nothing falling. Yeah, and the risk now is that he gets inside his own head. Time to take deep breaths in through the nose, out through the mouth, and let the game come to you. And that's it for the first half of action. What's been a very close game here. Bucks lead by one. A chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. Stand. And in that first half, we saw a pretty tight battle. We'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during the half. You look at Antetokounmpo, and this game has been everywhere. You just love the patience in that first half. Waited until he got the look he wanted. You love guys who can get their shots within the flow of the offense. The pairing up front is Harris and Embiid. Buddy Heald is out there with Maxi, and it's Oubre in at the three. That's the group on the floor for Philadelphia. Maxi passes to Embiid. He kicks it to Heald. Out 
outside. Maxi. Embiid sets the pick for Maxi. Krills the three pointer. Maxi's got 17. The number of threes are increasing for Maxi since he entered the league. He is getting more comfortable out there. And with an update from the sidelines, let's check in with David Aldridge. Thank you, Kevin. As ever, Joel Embiid has the pressure on him to be the franchise player. He said it's not an easy job. If it was easy, everybody would do it. When you're actually the best offensive player and the best defensive player, you got to make plays. You can't be perfect. All I can do is try to do my best every game. Kevin? Well said. His best DA is pretty great, isn't it? Thank you so much for the report. Here's Embiid. Shot by Heal. Nobody around. That's in. Coming off the assist from Embiid. Heald's got the lead up to three now for the 76ers. And for Milwaukee, they're shooting pretty good tonight at 48%. On the wing, Giannis. He's got 19. Middleton outside. Back to Giannis. Physical basketball from Giannis at the Kumbo. And the strength Giannis has in his upper body allows him to just brush off the contact and complete that play. Here's Maxi. Rebounded by the Bucks. They'll be playing host to Toronto for the next one. Giannis outside. Not quite two and a half minutes played here in the second half. Good on the shot. Giannis has got six in the quarter. And you can see the growing confidence that Giannis has in that mid-range. And, Greg, while the Sixers have been effect time and again, they've been unable to get past the conference semifinal. Where they bowed out in five of the last six years. But you go back, they haven't made it any further since Allen Iverson led them to the finals back in 01. Here's Middleton. He has seven. Lopez, a screen on Oubre. Here's Middleton. Doesn't go for him. Great D that time from Oubre. And it's Harris with the ball for the Philadelphia 76ers. They trail by one. Pass to Maxi. And here's MB. Lopez covering. And they double up MB. The 76ers need to get off a shot. Healed with the bucket. Man, the triples keep falling, guys. That's three in a row. Bucks have gone three of five to start the second half, developing a nice rhythm out. Giannis against Harris. Onto the combo. Converts inside. Ooh, he's on a bit of a heater now. He hasn't missed one this quarter yet. Alert against Maxi. Here's the pass to Heal. Another three for Philadelphia. Heal showing his quick release. Bucks trail by three. Outside, out of the Kumbo. Back to Lillard. Wide open look. Good. And it's Giannis picking up the assist. Lillard's got 13. And we talk about the importance of versatility. He's really got it all on the offensive end. Embiid with a screen on Lillard. Maxi kicks to Embiid. A three-pointer off the mark. For Milwaukee, they've gone 5 of 7 from the field in the third quarter. Let's see if they can keep it up. Outside, out of the Kumbo. 11 feet away. That one off the back iron and out. Philadelphia's gone 4 of 6 from three point land since the start of the second half. Oubre passes to Maxi. A floater. Lopez with the block. And we have seen Lopez really improve his shot blocking. Adept at using that length to alter shots. And it's Philadelphia with the rebound. Harris has got his sixth rebound on the night. He passes to Harris. Fires the three. Another miss by Philadelphia. That is not a guy you want to allow open looks from range. Lucky for the defense, he just couldn't get it to go. Lopez, a screen on Maxi.
Here's Lillard on the money from 12 feet away. He's got fifth. Maxi against Lillard. Passes it to Harris. Embiid sets the pick for Harris. Over Giannis. A nice shot by Harris. Harris with some finesse to knock down that little mid-range jumper. And Beasley has the ball here for the Milwaukee Bucks. Middleton outside. Beasley against Heald. Lillard right side. And easy two points on the layup. 28 points for him. Proof positive that Lillard is worthy. That's talent you can build a franchise around. Maxi passes to Embiid. He dishes it to Heal. Back to Embiid. Got a piece of it. Lopez with the steal. Embiid against Anadokounmpo. Dishes it to Middleton. Back to Anadokounmpo. Lopez inside. Harris is there. Lopez, no luck. And got to like what they've been doing down low in the post. Maxi on the wing. Covered by Lillard. Maxi kicks to MB. Oubre passes to Heal. Five on the clock. Maxi on the wing. From past the arc, another three for Philadelphia. Attacking in a big moment. Maxi is not holding back. Giannis against Harris. Lopez, a screen on Harris. Driving in. Oh, my wow. goodness. What a play. And you know he knows he's the leader of this team. Giannis embracing the opportunity to come through with big baskets. On our AT&T 5G Slam Cam, you just saw an explosive highlight. The 76ers leading by three. Here's Maxi over Lopez. Maxi, no good. Well, okay, well, I like his aggressiveness, but, like, the defense was waiting on him that time. Healed against Giannis. Poked loose. Embiid with the steal. And now here's Oubre. Fast break chance. Healed from outside. Giannis Antetokounmpo grabs the miss. Bucks trail by three. There's 117 left in the fourth quarter of this one. Rebound by the 76ers. Normally he drains that. To the middle. Can't get it to fall. And for Milwaukee, they're shooting well here in the fourth quarter. 50%. Three-pointer Lillard. That one, no good. And as long as he keeps missing from deep, the D will keep letting him fire away. He's just out from range right now. Stolen by Middleton. Lillard outside. And the push by Antetokounmpo! Oh, you just love seeing a player with absolutely no fear. He knew what they needed here and was determined to deliver. Fires from deep. Nails the trade! When it comes down to crunch time, Maxi wants the ball in his hands. Timeout called the Bucks. They're trailing by four. Now a timeout called by Milwaukee. They're down by four. Onto Takumbo, passes to Beast. It's in! And he has brought them to within two points. Nice little draw up there from the inbounds play to get them an easy bucket. And now we've got the intentional foul. There's 25 seconds left in the fourth quarter, and he commits the intentional foul. on the 
first, and that makes it a three-point lead. A chance for Hill to improve his team's situation. He seems cool and ready to deliver. And so he drops them both. It's a four-point ballgame. Well, they wanted every last one of those, and he delivered, making it a two-possession game. Here's Giannis. It's good. And a big-time playmaker. When the game is up for grabs, he can give the rock to Giannis. And they stop the clock as soon as they can with the intentional foul. Honestly, just doing what they have to in order to get the basketball back. So the first one drops, and that makes it a three-point lead. So he goes two for two at the line, and it's a four-point ball game. Solid at the line. We'll see if the late-game pressure affects Maxi. Adetokounmpo kicks to Lillard. Pass to Middleton for the three. Good! And what a sensational bucket to bring them within one. And this is why he gets paid the big bucks. Middleton enjoying. And now they foul and stop the clock. He hits the first one, and that will put them up by two. The thing you love about Maxi is that he always has a smile when he's out there. He's enjoying himself, and he embraces the challenge that the game presents while doing all he can to give them the edge, pulling their lead out to three points. On its way from Beasley for two, and that falls. So it's the 76ers taking the win in a close game. That was a fun night of basketball and fabulous finish as they continued to wait out until the very last moment to seal. And there are so many times when you see these tight games won at home, that advantage of having that crowd behind you often.